Oh, Nana is not for me. Well, I thought Onyeka saw her coming back from the market this morning. Oh, oh. Is that what Onyeka told you? <laughs> that Onyeka with his uh, half past eyes. Eh? Please. I'm sure it was not from Nana he saw. Probably saw somebody that looks like from Nana. And I told you that full money is not full. Yeah? Okay, then what of Papa is inside? Let me greet him. Papa is home, but he's sleeping. He left special instruction that he should not be woken up, no matter what. Excuse me? What do you mean? Is that anything, everything all right? You want me to be sick, fall ill, so that you will be happy? Why are you interrogating me in my own house? It's just me you are treating me. How am I treating you? Ah. Oh, come on. Oh, go oh, and come sleep come now. Who is that? Who is it? It's not, not an important thing. Oh. Ah. Well, listen, my son. You're welcome, my son. What did you return? Excuse just me, now. man. Yeah. Just now. Papa, what is going on here? I mean, what is going on in your house? My son, I will advise you to reach home first, rest, so we can talk later. Papa, why are you telling me to go home and rest? Eh? I came back to see you people, you are telling me to go and rest. Eh? I asked for food night, they said you're, you, you, she's not around. And I saw somebody that passed that looks like that. You, they said you are sleeping, that you, ah, I, Papa, what's going on? I, I didn't do any work that I need rest for. What's going on here? Madness. Madness has visited. This has Badness! That is what it is. What is your problem? Why are you shouting? Don't you know? I'm coming. Papa, please, mom. I'm coming. Don't you know I have visitors? Why are you embarrassing me? No, yeah. you said Fumnaya is not there. Is that not her voice? That is her voice, but not Fumnaya. Sometimes the voice can be in a different place. Why the body is in a different place? Papa, I'm coming. Please, stop shouting. I'm embarrassing my visitors. Start going. I don't understand this. What's the meaning of this? Please, I'm not your boy. I don't want somebody's box like that. Please. Hey, hey. I'm just going to get to the list. I'm going to get to the list. I'm going to get to the list. Trying to leave you. 
because she has left you. See, they call me Desmond. A dumb Desmond with an cash. Money talks bullshit works. You see this money right here? This mula baby is what I do for a living. I help people. You see, anything mama you want and laugh, I'll just order it like, real quick. So you don't need to worry about anything laugh because I'm bigger than laugh. Name it. You want it to be ordered from the United States? Mm -hmm. You want it from Malaysia? Mm -hmm. You want it from Afghanistan, Mama? Mm -hmm. You want it from South Africa, Jewelsburg? Mm -hmm. Beat in Japan. You want me to order from there? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what's up, Mama. I say, so you ain't got problem. Mm -hmm. I'm this one for me, my gosh. That's what they call me. Money talks. And they say, bushy words. They say, oh, the Mama, 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 you, you got a problem. And I tell you something, man. What you ought to be doing in your life, at all time, go to church and say, Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord, is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed the fruit of their womb, Jesus. Father Almighty, I thank you for bringing this month. The dawn this morning into our life. I thank you for bringing the dawn this morning into our family. I'll do that, my son. I'll do that. I trust you, Mama. I trust you. Now, without time wasting, like I said, money talks bullshit words. This so called Mula baby. Mula baby. Mula baby. Mama, this for you. I'm there. I've not started. I ain't started yet. That's Mula right there. Baby, this is for you right there. For me? Hey, thank you. That's for me. Baby, I told you I'll do anything and laugh for you. As long as you keep being good, you're my responsibility. As long as you keep being good, you will shine until you die. Now, where's Papa? He has gone up. Okay. That's for Papa right there. This month, this is too much for us. Mama, I've always told you, stop saying, what? I'm not even starting yet. You see, I live this life for you all. You are the only family that I know in this life. So if I don't do it for you, who do I do it for? No, if I don't do it for my baby, who do I do it for? If I don't do it for my boo, who do I do it for? If I don't do it for my shorty, who do I do it for? You see, I'm going to turn this village upside down because of my goal. I don't joke with my goal. I don't joke with my swing. I don't joke with my boo. Hey. Now, Mama, listen, I'm listening real good. Yes. I've got a surprise for y'all. You do? Yeah. What? I want to get a new whip for my girl. Whip? A whip? To whip her? Ah, come on. You see what I keep saying? That's what I want to take you all out. So I'm great you all a little so you can be a little bit more exposed and laugh. Whip means car. Cool. Car! That's what I'm talking about. Hey, he's gonna get you car! That's what it is, mama. Hey, you get car! Thank you so much, my Baby, darling. you don't need a mission. You don't need a mission. Thank you. Don't need you. you don't need to step thank you, man. Your laugh is my laugh. Your laugh is my laugh. <laughs> so, Mama, like I said, you ain't got a problem. Everything is covered up. 
So I think I'll be leaving. I'll see you all later in the day. Is that okay? Then I'll come through with my father. I'll, I'm gonna come through with my dad. Well, let me see him. Okay, okay. So like I told you, anything for my baby, anything for my boo, anything for my baby, anything. Be good, be good, man. The dawn, the dawn. I'm gonna come through with my dad. Yes. <laughs> I don't know who that boy is. Hey, now that God has brought out our bread, oh, eh? you're not being a uh, 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 cooperative. I mean, it doesn't make sense. Which God? The same God you were jumping up and down, thanking when Ulisa came to pay for Naya's school fees. That same God? Okay. Do you know that God has just remembered us? Our house is flowing with honey. So what else would you want from God? Eh? Not that type of honey. There must be sand inside that honey. I don't enjoy so much. Good honey doesn't come like that. Hey. This one that is doing his eyes, chan chan chan, it's not good. It's not a good thing. You've not even tasted the honey yet and you're complaining about sand. Anyway, this is the money that I said I should give to you. I just didn't away from you. Did I ask him for money? So you're not taking the money? No problem. Look, let me tell you. Whatever you people are planning with that young man, count me out of it. I am not part of it. But there's something I want to tell you. Right. If you chase this boy away with this your attitude, you will not find peace here. Mark my words. <laughs> I will make life unbearable for you. <laughs> This is pure madness. Okay. When the trouble comes. Um, before the trouble, since you're not taking this money, I'll go to the market and get that job. I've been begging you to buy for me, sis. Who told you that? I couldn't believe what my eyes saw today. <laughs> I don't believe that. Hmm? For Maya that I know, loves Olisa with all her heart. I mean, she is deeply in love with Olisa. <laughs> For Maya cannot be with another man. It's not possible. My dear, I couldn't believe it myself. That's why I want you to ask her. Please, talk to her. <laughs> This is serious, though. Anyway, no problem. I'll go to phone Naya. Then I'll ask her if all this thing that you're telling me is actually true. If she's marrying another man. Not just marrying. Is she seeing someone else? I don't want anybody to hurt my friend. Not even, not not from Naya. So when are you going back? My dear, I'm not going back again. Hmm? Akokalia has gotten me a job in our community's microfinance bank. Really? Oh God! Oh God, I'm so happy! I'm so happy! Hi! Hey, God, I thank you. Eh? Ha, may God continue to bless you. May He strengthen you. May he keep opening doors for you in Jesus' mighty name. I pray. Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh my God, baby. I never knew all this while that I had a prophetess as a girlfriend all this while. Baby, baby, cool. baby, baby. Mm -hmm. you know what I want? No. Huh? I will give you anything you want today. I'll come and wait for me. Hearing. What are you hearing? That you're seeing another man. Why do you like gossip a lot? Why? Are you trying to tell me that what I heard is not true? Is that why you came here? Tell me! Is that why you are here? To discuss my private life? Eh? From Naya, if what I heard is true, 
It's not fair. Uh -uh. I do not want to talk about that. If that is why you've come, then please, I don't want to talk about it. If you won't help me, then leave it. So, Naya, for crying out loud, you are my cousin and my best friend. Yeah. If I hear anything bad, I have to come to you and ask you. Ask me what? What are you asking me, Eberi? After you've sat down with them and gossiped me, now you're telling me you're my sister, you're my this. Let them gossip. I don't care. Oh. They should gossip all they can. I don't care. I don't. Shonaya, I have this feeling that something bad is about to happen. Something bad? Yes. You are feeling that something bad is about to happen? <laughs> Professor Ebere, keep feeling. You will not talk about something else, oh. It's just me. By the way, it's your turn. Let's talk about you for once at least. Uh, I know you want to... You want us to change the topic. Eh, uh, we have to change the topic. Because we've been talking about me all this while. It's your turn. No problem. Let's talk about me. How about Onyeka? Your boyfriend. My Onyeka is fine. He has gotten a job in our community's microfinance bank. And he'll be starting job next week, Monday. Hey! <laughs> that's a good news! <laughs> My dear, this is what we are begging God for. Good news! Uh -uh, what is that? At least, you can be able to buy you cream. Look at you. How <laughs> <laughs> oh, dry You are insulting me. No, I'm giving you the permission. Insult me more. Hey, my sister, seriously. Eh? <laughs> Let me tell you. Let's be sincere to ourselves. Mm -hmm. Every girl on earth needs a man that can comfortably take care of her needs. It's very, very important. No, from Nanya. No man on earth can provide all that a woman wants. It's not possible. Story. <laughs> For you. From now, uh, seriously, if you ask me, I prefer love. Hmm? You see, love is very, very important. Yeah. A man can give you all he has in this world, but without love, it is useless. Okay. I am telling you the truth. Mm. Or are you trying to tell me that you're not enjoying how Olisa has been treating me and loving you? First and foremost, Nobody in this life will love, don't help. Who love help? Hmm? Will you eat love? And for your information, it's not Olisa that is taking care of me. It's Olisa, Biniwe, God in heaven that has been taking care of me. Not Olisa, oh. please. Naya, wait though. I don't understand. I don't understand you. You are sounding strange. Yes. My dear, the only constant in life is change. And as a matter of fact, I have not changed negatively. I have changed positively. I am now a matured woman. Yes. Real woman indeed. Sokota has really changed you. Positively. <laughs> Positive change. You are telling me that Fum Naya did not come out to see you at all. At all. The only thing I could figure out is that while I was in their living room, I noticed she passed from another room to the other. And she saw me but she turned her face. Hey! All I know is that there is something to be loved by something fishy. What? Well, I think they are up to something. Because the way the moon treated me like a total stranger it was amazing. Eh? I, I was full of shock. People can change. But not worse. There is nothing hidden under the surface of this earth. Hmm. Well, uh, what I want to ask is this. Let's forget about what the government did. I don't know the type of a woman she is. What did they do? Nothing. Huh? Yes. Apart from the fact that once in a while he just escalates and just say this or that. But eventually, the only thing I could figure out that he said is that madness has visited his house. He said it. Yes. That madness has visited him. He's right then. Yes. Madness indeed. Madness has visited him. In fact, madness is already dwelling with him. Huh? So, something is actually wrong somewhere. But all I know is this. We have to apply wisdom here. Let us just use our legs to fish out whatever has fallen inside the snow. Papa, Mama, I just want to believe that it's not what I'm thinking that is about to happen though. 
Because if it happens, I'm not going to take it easy. I will not. I will not take it easy. Calm down, my son. Yeah? Calm down. Let's watch and see. Let's see what. But what if I'm coming down and things that goes out of hand? Yeah? What? My son, what will be will certainly be? That is it. Huh? What is it? Nothing will even go wrong. See? And in this matter, we have just two options. To handle it or to leave it where it is. But that is it. Huh? Your father is correct if you ask me. I just don't understand this. I don't get it. Mm. Mama, I hope there's no problem. Hey, Mama. What did you buy for me from the city? Baby, why are you behaving as if you did not miss me? Why you did? Why are you also pretending as if nothing happened? To you, what happened in your house yesterday was child play? Oh, baby, come on. I was going to... What are you talking about? You're still talking about yesterday? Because it's serious to me. Yeah, because you that did it will forget, but I was heartbroken. I didn't sleep all through the night. Sweetie, I'm sorry. I'm here now with you, okay? Okay. Hmm? How is business? Fine. It's okay now. Uh -uh. You shouldn't be angry with your love like that. Fumo na ya. Oh, you're welcome, sir. Mm -hmm. You are here. Thank you, sir. Baby, come on, I'm sorry. It's me, or it's your phone, Nanya. My darling, I'm sorry. I apologize once again. Deeply sorry. Okay? Uh, get up. Let's go inside. So you give me what you bought for me from the city. Oh! <laughs> Wait. 
I just pray that you will not break his heart later. Uh, what kind of fuck is that? <laughs> I know what I'm saying. Hmm? You're already in school. And school might open your eyes. You start seeing Olisa as a common man. What for? Uh uh. Eberio, why would you say such? How can I see my own Olisa? My sweetest heart. As a common man. I will never do that. Please, don't say it again. Okay, yes. God will forbid it. Eh? But I know why I'm saying this. I just want you to have it at the back of your mind. That Olisa is one man you shouldn't hold. He is such a caring man. I can never hold Olisa. I love him so much. How can I hurt a tall, handsome, young man? Whom God has given to me to wipe my tears and that of my family. I can't do that. Who will throw such a man away? Who will not embrace a man like Olisa? Baron. Say that because you're my sister. I know. Yeah, <laughs> that's what you will say. <gasps> hey. So how is cool? Yeah, it's fine. Oh, you see me now? Now you're shiny. Hey. Hey. Hi. Hi, uncle. My father. He went to Mars Yo KK's bar to enjoy himself as usual. Uncle hmm. can enjoy. <laughs> my sister, that's a sign. You know you're such a wonderful cook. And I said to myself. Oh, Naya, you will not come back to this village and return back to school without enjoying a parent's daily <laughs> Please, my sister, I'm hungry. I see if I knew you were coming. I prepared a very delicious <laughs> And you know it's your favorite. African salad. I am telling you. <laughs> I decided to come and see you first. Yeah, I'm cool. How is Mama? Uh, okay, let's go and see. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. Please take care of her. We're coming back, okay? Bye. So how are you? How are you doing? I'm fine. Why are you not looking at me? Are you dashing? Mama. My son. How are you, Mama? I am fine, no. <laughs> yeah. Just this my eye. I started again. Mm. It will be solved this time around. Mm -hmm. Yes. I'll be taking you to a specialist hospital in Kaduna. Oh. Where they will take care of your eye. Mm. And by a specialist, even at that. Take me to Kaduna? Yes. For eye treatment? Yes. Ah! Take me care of it. <laughs> God bless you. God bless you and replenish your pocket. Hey! Um, what of Papa? Papa, he has gone out to see his brother Anika. But he'll be back soon. Uh, okay, no problem. Go go so that I can give you the things that I want. No problem. <laughs> Mama, go in at it. Okay. Well, however, get prepared though. Maybe after tomorrow we'll be into Kaduna. Are you ready? Mama, I'm fine. Where are you going to? I'm fine. 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 Okay. All right, Mama. And then... Later. Okay, see you before. They think I don't know where they're going to. This girl has stopped going to church since she started dying. Oh. I didn't do it with her father, I was very careful. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I hope you guys are not talking about us. 
Must we discuss you? We are discussing the matter ourselves. See, you, I don't trust you. Come here, ask yourself. I don't trust you. Come here. I told you time with that number that you should stop praising me or thanking me. Everything I did, I did it for you, for us. I know, but there are a few men in this life that have a heart of gold. And you're one of them. You're different. Same way. There are a few women like you who are this sweet and wonderful. Mm. <laughs> That's the reason why I pray so hard begging God to give you grace to graduate on time so that you can be my wife. Are you serious? Yes. Okay. Once I'm done from the university, you can go and see my people. Send it. Send it! Send it and we <laughs> Oh my God. You know what? Mm. I think we should go inside and start practicing how to be husband and wife. Mm. Yes. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> this one you're sitting like this, at your blouse. Oh, yeah. What is it? Mom, I'm not happy at all. I'm feeling very guilty. Guilty? Guilty for what? Mama, you sound as if you don't know. You're telling me to leave Olisa and get married to Desmond. If I marry Desmond, that will hurt Olisa so much. Mm. Olisa has done enough for me. For us, Mama. Okay. So what is it that Olisa has done for you and us? That no other human being has done for anybody. Mama. Eh? Why are you sounding as if you've forgotten so soon? He has done a lot for us. Wait, so you're trying to tell me you cannot exist without Olisa, eh? Is that what you're saying? Now let me ask you a question. When you met Olisa, were you not a virgin? Mama? Yes! Answer now. Then Olisa came and you opened up for him. And he took the special thing meant for your husband. So, he's give and take. He took from you and gave you back. Mama! So don't tell me about what he has done for you. Mama, stop this thing you're saying. I don't oh, like it. Just, 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 just stop telling me to stop it. Okay, answer me. Are you still a virgin? Are you a virgin now? Mama, stop now. Oh, yeah. Mama, please. I can't pay Olisa enough for what he has done for me. Uh, my, my daughter, please stop talking about Olisa. Think about Desmond. Desmond is a good man and he is rich. He will take care of us. Mama, you keep talking about getting married to Desmond. What about love? I'm not even sure if he truly loves me. <sighs> that is not a problem. By the time you move into his house, you will know that he truly loves you. From the little I've seen him, what he's been doing and the way he's been taking care of, it is very obvious he loves you. Mama, why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Why? You really want to know why? Eh? You know, you think you're in love with Olisa, right? I was in love with your father. When you talk about love, people knew us now. I was in love with him and that was why I married him. You know Akwe Lili? Of who's yes, He me. came to marry me now. Who is richer than Akwe Lili around here? He came to marry your mother. But I turned him down because I was in love with your father. Do you know that when I go for meetings and I meet Akwe Lili's wife, I hide. Because I always come in this wrapper that is like nylon, falling all over the place. This woman will wear the best of judges. Cold lace, big, big cloth. I'll be hiding myself. Even when I see a queen in his jeep and he wants to wave, I, I take cover. You don't need it. You understand what I'm telling you? 
But Mama Mayolisa is not poor. He's not a poor man. He's okay. He's okay. <laughs> Olisada can't even manage himself. That's Olisada has been riding one car for the past five years. He's not a poor man. You're waiting for him to get down to Keke before you call him poor. Do you know every time I go around that uh, uh, mechanic workshop, Olisada is there fixing the car. If he's not looking up mechanic to, he's helping him to knock, knock. If mechanic is under knocking, Olisa will be on top covering or knocking. If mechanic is on top knocking, Olisa will be under blowing. What kind of poverty is that? As old as he is, he's still living in his mother's house. My daughter, if you marry this, <laughs> your whole situation will change. This man is rich. He has cars. He has his own house. When I come for for uh, 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 um, I will have somewhere to stay. Feel free and feel like a big woman. You change my clothes. If you marry Lisa, you know that his mother is as big as myself now. We'll be trying to sit on one chair. Maybe one day the chair will even break. You know that chair in that corner in their house where she's always sitting. Don't go there, please. I know why I'm trying to protect you. Besides, knowing this month is already showing in our lives. Eh? So, my daughter, I go. Again? How many times will you greet me this afternoon? Eh? But I want to tell you that Desmond and his people are coming this weekend. And how is that my business? Oh, they are coming to pay my bride price. Look, I want to rest. Just leave me alone. I don't want to talk about some rascal now. Oh, but Desmond is not a rascal. I don't need you to tell me what he is or not. Now, let me ask you, Christian. Have you taken time to look at that young man? Does he look like somebody that wants to get married to you at that matter? Huh? Does he look like somebody that knows the value of a woman in a man's life? What he cares about is brag and boast about that sum of money he has. Papa, I'm not complaining. I love him like that. I'm not complaining. I don't care if you are complaining or not. But listen to me. Count me out of that thing you and your mother started. I will not be a part of it. And I don't want to talk about it again. Leave. Mm. Now let's leave this place. young man that came back from overseas and the man is handsome, he is loaded, he's very rich and he's asking for full and in marriage. But well, my your brother, my husband is against it. Why would you refuse a thing like that? Oh, well I think it's because of that we decided to train the full in school. So he's not going to be support of any other person. I don't really want you to talk to me. What I'm here to ask of you is to stand in for him. Act like Fu Nanya's father when the in-laws come. After all, you're your elder brother. Yeah. If Nanya is also your daughter. Hey, by the way, this is something good from our in-law. I want you to enjoy with me. This is just small. Huh? Yes, sir. There's more from where that is coming. Hey! Don't worry. Eh? I will even invite you. Mindset. I don't fuck up. Oh, dear. 
We don't need to invite all those people. We don't want a crowd. My angel wants to use money to cover everything. So we don't really need a crowd. Oh, just your presence. Mm. That's all we need. Okay. Just come to me. This is what I always talk about you. You're always very supportive. Okay. And you're very understanding. <laughs> you know, and if you can have to be on my way now, eh? Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bless you. Thank you. Where did you get all this money from? What is your problem this day? Where do you ask where this money is coming from? Will you go inside there and prepare me food? To the truth. Tell me the truth. Has police offended you in any way? No, Papa. He has not offended you. Yes. Then what is going on? Nothing, Papa. Nothing is going on. Martin? Yes, Papa. I just needed a breath of fresh air. What does that one mean? Papa, can't I have another friend again? Polisa is not the only man in this world. I have right to mingle. You have not answered my question, as you know that. What do you mean by breath of fresh air? Papa, I want you to know that I'm a grown-up woman now. And I know exactly what I want in a man. Ah. And uh, you don't want police any longer? Papa, I never said so. But it is not ordained that Olisa is my husband. God did not create me and made it mandatory that I must get married to Olisa. No, it's not like that. You're making it... Look as if I'm a very wicked person, but I am not. Uh, he saw me through school. Uh -huh. Is he the only one that have trained someone in the university? He is not. Please, you shall allow me or I'll not kill myself for him. Let me tell you the truth. If you go ahead to do what you and your mother are planning to do, you are not just wicked, but you are heartless. Papa! Where did you go ahead to give the young man hope? When you know that he was no longer good enough for you? What? Now, I want you to remember how everything started. Because I remember it, I had it in my hand, like yesterday. Tell me then, you just mind your business before Mama! Yes? Olisa oh, has promised to send me to the university! <laughs> what did you say? I said he has promised to send me to the university! Hey! Olisa oh, promised to send you to the university? Papa, I, ah! I will be starting school on Saturday. It is confirmed! Hey. Awesome God! Awesome God you are! University! Yes, sir! Olisa! Oh, that boy has the heart of a father. I'm telling you. Let me just like, say thank you to him. It's not let me. Let us. Let us. Come on, you. Let's go. Hey. 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 Hey.
two of you because I feel I have something important to say to you. We all know that things are very hard. Yet, Olisa wants to pay for Naya's uh, university school fees. I think he has lifted a heavy burden off my shoulders. Off our shoulders. And uh, I would want us to always remember him in our prayers so that his pocket will never run dry. Thank you, my dear. You know, those days that we were thinking of where to raise money for, to pay for her school fees, I mean, I had sleepless nights. Every night I'd stay awake and wonder and think. And this young boy, such a child, comes and decides to pay for her school fees. Oh. There's only cause that can pay for her. Amen. I will never in my life forget this good question. Never. Never. It is good that we don't forget it. For me, there is something that Olisa saw in you. He saw the star in you that attracted him. Please, don't let that star run deep. Don't disappoint us. Always remember where you came from and put God first in everything you do. Please. But I promise you, I will never disappoint you. Thank you, that's all right. I trust my daughter. You see this girl? Yes. I trust my daughter. <laughs> I said it two times for emphasis. <laughs> <laughs> I know the kind of person she is. That's all right. Now, that, um, I give Yes. I don't know if we can bring it to you. Like. Yes, I'm already hungry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 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 In my next life, I will marry you. <laughs> oh, yeah, yes, my dear, please sit down. Oh, just sit down. Hey! Very sweet. You cooked very well. As usual. Thank you. Thank you. As usual. Hey! Uh, 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 uh. I want you to know that Olisa and Fumlanya will strengthen the relationship between the two families. And I want us to avoid anything, any act at all, that will cut the relationship between the two families. Nani, I understand where you're coming from. Thank you. And I want to assure you from now on, yes. I have taken him as my own son. Oh, no one thank would you. want to hurt his own person. <laughs> thank you so much. That is what I mean. We shall take him as our own. Our own now. No problem. <laughs> thank you so much. Please get me more water. More water. If you okay. Want. Definitely, he will not remember where it stopped. Holy Sunday. And his people saw something in you. And they love you as they are born. I know, Papa. Do you also know that it is a terrible thing to bite the finger that fits you? Do you know why it is important to announce the coming of the rain before it eventually comes? Uh, Papa, I know exactly where you're heading to. And I promise you, my father, I will never disappoint you. Don't 
Look at my eyes. Don't fail me. Never. Never. You are welcome, my daughter. High school. School is fine. Welcome. Because your daughter is now a graduate. You don't mean that. Yes. You graduated. Baba Fumnaya. Baba Fumnaya. Come, 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 come and hear this with your ears. Come, come, come. Hey! Okay. Fumnaya. Mama. Did he tell me you were coming? That is because I have a surprise for you. Surprise? Yes, Mama. Well, what is the surprise? Which is that your daughter, Fumnaya, is now a graduate! Woo! I can't believe this! My daughter is graduate? I'm telling you, Mama. Hey! Only Sam. Only Sam, my son. Only boy! Only Baba! God will bless you. Amen. You will see no harm. Amen. Amen. Anybody that tries to harm you, eh? Hey, God will massacre. He will destroy. He will get everything bad. God Amen. will do to the person. Amen. Amen. Hey! You know what? This God's face situation. Oh, yeah. What's happening? Let's go inside. Come on, my God. Come on, my God. Hey! 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 Let me ask you one question. All right. Um, you have been visiting Olisa in the city. Yes, I do. Has he said anything to you? Like he wants you. Papa. No, no, no. I'm a man. <laughs> you know, I'm a man, and uh, I've seen that he he likes you. Yeah. Has he said anything like that? See, Papa, he wants it to be official. Mm, and we both agree that after my NYC, then he will come and meet you for the proper rights. Oh, so that means two of you already have it in mind. Yes. <laughs> Papa. Papa. That's what I want to hear. Yes, we love ourselves. Mm. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, what about you? Have you told your mother? Mama knows now. She knows already. Uh -huh. Yes, she does. And she has kept it from me all this while. Mother and child. <laughs> you must hear everything, Papa. Uh, <laughs> yes, Papa. Hey! Mm. Papa, why will you keep dwelling in the past? This whole thing is gone. Allow it to remain in the past. Uh -uh. It is the past that brought the present. And the present we bring tomorrow. If we don't have the past, we won't have the present, and we won't have the future. When you were running off your new service, both of you agreed. You told me that both of you agreed to get married by January. Papa, Papa, that was then. I changed my mind. I'm no longer interested. You changed your mind. Now, when you change your mind, did you tell him? He is a human being. You would have told him earlier enough for him to move ahead with his life. He can always move ahead with his life. He's so beautiful. It's his life. Have you put yourself in his shoes? Papa, why should I put myself in his shoes? Papa, please. I did not mean to be disrespectful. But I was doing something inside when you called me. And I want to return to what I was doing. I will not hinder you from doing what you were doing. You can go ahead and go for the whole world if you like. But God will bear me witness that my hand is not in what you and your mother are doing. So that when the law of karma will come, lacerating your back, I will be here to laugh at you. I will laugh at you. Karma does not have any right or any power over me. Karma can never do me anything. Don't worry. We are all here. I will be here. You are there. We will see. We will see. 
Yes, I know. And uh, I also hope that she told you that I am not in support of what they are planning. Did hey. she tell you that? Oh, I wonder why you are not in support of such good thing. Coming your home. What is the good thing coming my home? That Fumanya will leave the boy that suffered and trained her in the university to marry a total stranger. What is good about it? Ouch, and Yes? Uh, let me tell you right now. If on that day you refuse to be present, eh? I, Anika, I will go ahead give uh, Fumanya's hand in marriage to this month. And that's all. Am I complaining? I didn't say you shouldn't give a hand in marriage to this month, but you must bear the consequence with your head. Just that. Which consequences? Eh? The consequence that will follow. Be ready to bear it. Look at good things coming our, into our family. You want to reject it? Something good happened before now. And that good thing is only sir. And he left the whole house open. Oh, I was in a hurry. Who brought all those things at the back of the house? What are you talking about? Food stores like uh... meats, stock fish, even firewood and drinks. I don't know. Ah. What do you mean by you don't know? Maybe it's Mama that kept them. I don't know. I'm not sure. What could Mama be doing with all those things? Baby, I just told you that I do not know. I'm just coming back. I don't know. Punaya, is this something you're not telling me? Baby, what's your problem? Why are you questioning me? I don't know now. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Yeah. Now your daughter is getting married. <laughs> oh, that? Of course she's getting married. Oh, you've not heard? Hey, God has been awesome. He sent one wonderful man over. Very tall, fair like this. Uh, they call him the dawn. He wants to marry my daughter. He is loaded, I'm telling you. The same daughter you couldn't kill. You can't pay her university. You ask her to go and learn how to sew. And I took it upon myself, begged my son to train that girl. At the end of the day, you are telling me this. He's getting married to the dad. He has money. Look at what you're saying. You! No more you say. Forward ever. Backwards never. After all we've done for your family, you trained. Your son trained my daughter. So? You are the one saying this. Yes! I thought your son was running a charity organization. So, must my daughter die? Because your, your, your son trained her in the university. People train people and nothing is tied to it. Your son is not destined to marry my daughter, else this dog would not have come our way. What are we talking about? Listen, even WHO gives money to Nigeria. When we don't pay it back, they don't even harass us. So what's the big deal? Eh? I'm so disappointed. You're very 
of grateful. Look at you. See the way you're talking now. Your mouth is blah, 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 blah. You've forgotten so soon. Don't you know what is happening in this country? Who is the president? Who, boo? What has that got to do with what I'm saying? Have you heard of recession? Have you? So you want me and my daughter to die at this period? Your son has nothing to offer. Your daughter, you couldn't take care So good. Your daughter, you could not send to school. You're telling me about the country. What has that got to do with this? We need to survive. Mama Lisa, we need to survive. We were dying until this dawn stepped into our life. You know, singing. There's nothing we can do about it though. We're moving forward, my dear. I'm, I'm sorry, Biko. Let your anger not be too high. Just, you know, I'm surprised. I'm really, really surprised that you're saying this. You're vomiting this thing from your mouth. Well, you know what? We will pay back whatever. I will tell Dawn and we'll collect the receipts from your son, calculate everything and pay you in dollars. Biko, all right? Thank you. My man is telling me that that money he collected from Mama from Nanya was a bribe. Let me your boss on me. Papa, I'm not raising my voice on you. But if what I'm thinking is right, then you're not a good man. So, a better is have grown so wide as to stand before me and cost me anyhow? Look, if you don't live here now, I will curse you! Eh? Papa, Papa, I'm just saying my own. Just make sure you don't sell your hand with evil. Back it up! Get out of Look at this bed. What is going on? What do you mean what is going on here? Are you getting married? From Nana, I am talking to you. Bring your voice down. We have visitors inside. From Nana, are you trying to marry another man? After all Olisa has done for you. What's your problem? What's your business? I'm a grown-up woman. I know a certain what I want from a man. Please. Hey. Nanya, so this is true. Go for Nanya. Leave me now. Oh, for me. This is sick. I can see you don't like good things. But you know what? We love good things. Yes. Now get out of my house. Mama, do you want to kick you? If you go now, we go. You don't want to go. Direction. Didn't I? What are you talking about today? Umnanya is getting married today in a Loki. Do you see it with your own eyes or 
somebody told you. I saw it. I saw it with my eyes. Is it the problem I have with you? Why do you trust this game? You should don't trust me, your friend, right? I'm tired of talking with this. If you don't believe me, go there and see things for yourself. Or wait till tomorrow you get the news. Uh, our in law, the bright price in this community has not changed. It's 15,000 only. Well, we'll give you five thousand. Huh? That's say no more. You know what? Respect me, Sean. Make money and shine. What did I say? Make money and shine. Say it again. Make money and shine. We can do better than this. Make money and shine. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> This is one bread. Hundred thousand naira for just bread, right? Hey, son, it's important to touch. What's the matter? Now listen, listen. I want you all. What did I say? I want you all. Deliberate on this issue, like talk like men, discuss whatever comes up, like an addition to whatever you want me to do. You know what to do, I'm with you. Did I ever tell you that I will give this man my daughter's son in marriage? Did I? Huh? My brother, where are you going? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you going to? Eh? You had better not step out of this compound. If you do, we will continue to have a track. Go ahead. And he curses upon himself. Why would I heap, heap curses on myself? After all, we're, we're dressed in the same color. Let us do this thing together. Yeah. <laughs> What is going on inside? From Nanya and the mother have disappointed me. They have disappointed me. Myself, what I want you to understand is that I am not part of what is happening inside. Mama from Naya. Eh? What? what are you doing here? Mama, 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 I, Mama, hold on now, Mama, Mama, stop. Oh, 
You're getting me scared. Stop! Stop this thing you're doing. Stop this. Hey! Onyeka, do you know this world is terrible? Yes, I know. I know. Do you also know that the people living in this world are terrible people like them? Olisa, stop. Hey! Olisa, listen to me. Let's go. On this, there's nothing you can do about it. Okay? I'm hot. I'm hot too. Stop! Stop me! This is Meru. Look at how people are looking at us. Uh, hey! Okay, let's go. Don't break the heart. What are you doing? Don't break the heart. Hey! People of this world are terrible. This one is just terrible. What kind of thing is this now? Oh. Hold yourself. Hold yourself. Eh? Hold yourself. Will you die because Fumnaya and her mother decided to shock us? It's okay. It's okay. Hold yourself. Hold yourself. Huh? But you see that woman, that woman will never go punished. Yeah. She will never go punished. Yes. Yeah. She will be served with the same place that she served my son with. What I don't understand, Mama, is what she gave to my Fumnaya. Oh, what she did to her. I made Fumnaya to turn around on me like this. What have I done for her? The that I should cry, even in vain and in song. There's no way from Naya called me that I did not answer her. No. <laughs> Look at what you did to me, that is it fair? Ah! Oh. It's not fair, but it's okay. Get hold of yourself. You are a man. Yeah, Maybe man. that is how God wants it. Uh, and I support your mother. Could be the way God wants uh, it. Let's go. But this is terrible. Stop that. Hey, my man. Should be where? In the stomach. <laughs> where is my own food? Your own food? Which food? For the past two days, I've not been served food in this house. Papa, I don't understand you. Huh? Were you not the very one that said that you do not want to have anything to do with this man or his money? For your own information, all the food items in this house 
We are bought with Desmond's money. Including the tubers of yam in my bun? Must we eat yam all the time? If you want to eat yam, go there and eat. There are no goats that eat yam. Alright. Hey! Darling! Please, when coming back, get us another cup of water. Papa, <laughs> I don't understand this mama's family. When is she coming back? You talk as if you don't know the name. She will want to finish everything. You just am hungry. You know I'd be there. I don't normally stop on the way to eat. Let's wait for her a little while. Mm. She will soon be back. Mm? And how is Abuja now? Abuja is just there. Only that it's getting hotter and hotter every day. That's what we see in northern Nigeria. I saw your car outside. I was wondering. You didn't tell me you're coming. Mama, you know I always want to surprise you. <laughs> how are you? You're good. <laughs> you're full of surprises. Yes. My husband, how are you? Hi. Fine, my wife. <laughs> my hard working wife. Well, well, well done with you. Yeah. <laughs> good afternoon. Uh -huh. How are you? I'm fine. Her name is uh, from Naya. She's the girl that is helping me in this house. Yeah. Very hard working. Awesome. <laughs> Thank you, my dear. God bless you. Yeah? For Thank helping you. my mother. God bless you. Yeah. Welcome, Mama. Mama, I'm very hungry. I don't know if there's any food in this house. How can I never cook something like that? If there is food in my house. There's a lot of food in my kitchen. Let me go and wash my hands and get you something to eat. Yeah. You're asking if she has food. She has food herself. Mm. And my mother is food herself. Mm. <laughs> Mama, mm -hmm. I want to start going. Let me go and drop it. Excuse me. Come, let's go to the kitchen and get something for them to eat. Mm -hmm. huh? Thank you, my dear. I'm coming. Okay. She's a nice girl. She's a nice girl. Very hard work. I walked on the front. The boy will catch you some fingers. I don't know. Mama, I want to go to school. I do not want to be a tailor. I did very well in my exams. I even scored above the cutoff mark. Yeah. Mama, please, I need to go to school. Don't worry. It's okay. Stop crying. Wipe your tears. You will go to school. I'll get my son to help you. Yeah? Mama, you do that? Yes. Oh, Mama, thank you so much. Told me that her father wants her to learn tailoring. He doesn't have money to train her in the university. And that girl is very intelligent. She has been helping me all the time. Very beautiful girl. I see. My son. Mm -hmm. Is there any how you can be of help to her? Please. I want you to help her. Mama, you know how it is now. You know how the economy is. My whole capital is tied down to those goods that I'm expecting from China. Yes, you said so. Mana, at least, just small now. Thank you. Thank you. She's very intelligent. 
beautiful and she's always helping me. That girl is always helping me. I really want you to help her. Come on, girl. I'll see what I'll do now. Just give that to me. Oh, so, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Mama, I've always known that you were looking for such an opportunity like this. Yeah. So that you can connect you and her together. <laughs> what do you mean, how? <laughs> mama, I'm not a small boy. Mm. I'm not a small boy, Mama. <laughs> and I know you. I know when you're up to something. <laughs> I know you're not a small boy. And I know what is good for you. Okay, boy. Well, I want to go. I'll see you later. You go back to school. Yes, you will. I need you to go home now. List out all the necessary that you need to get before you leave for school. Especially your school fees, accommodation and feeding and all the things that you can remember that are very necessary. Bring it here tomorrow. Okay? Then I'll see what I can do. It's not if I'm down for me. It's only God that was supposed to kneel before. Yeah? Just go home and do what I asked you to do. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you. Papa. I'm going to die. Yes, Papa. Sir. Big well, my son. Will you listen to us? I had a few things. You did what? Uh, do this things. Go and uh, get that keg of palm wine. Let's say <clears throat> Celebrate your advance. Papa, what is not fair? I shouldn't be listening to people when two adults are involved in a conversation. He's not nice. Please forgive me. I want to be next time. But please let the, the discussion continue. I'm going there. Ah. I'll try and send them um, the remaining money for you by Monday latest. It's just that times have been very hard now and market is not even moving at all. I understand, but our exams are starting on Tuesday. Okay, I'll see what I'll do. Even if he requires me to borrow, I will borrow. I'll send you. You just don't want me. Just promise me that you study your books and stay out of trouble. So I'll do that. I'll study my books and I'll make you proud. Thank you. Thank you very much. Is the most beautiful thing. For all that you've been doing for this family. I mean, it's because of you that my daughter is in the university. God will bless and replenish your pocket. Amen. <laughs> no matter be told, it's not about me, it's about God. Because if I hadn't done it, God will still use some other person to fulfill this purpose. You're right, but God chose you. Yeah, I should be calling you the chosen one, you know. <laughs> yeah? Look, he chose you because what you're doing for us here, I mean, look at her. You know, the other day we were thinking of how to put money together for her to go to the university. Now she's in her final year. And then we so call me graduate man. It's due to your good nature. And we really appreciate it. Yeah. Nah. You're back. What is it? You're in our house. Yes, ma'am. Welcome. 
You already have Eh, Papa, you know, uh, I need to drop her at the park early so that she can get a good bed. Calabar is not here. Yes, my son. Thank you so much. It's only God that will repay you for all the good things you've been doing for us. Amen, Papa. My son. Thank you so much. I want to ask of one thing. Before you go back to the city, please, I would appreciate it if you can come and visit us. Oh, Mama. I'm going to come and eat good food. Hey! Hi, Unisa! Hello, 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 Unisa! Nah, I'll be going. Let me look at my daughter. Oh. Bye! Hey, she's holding her tight. I just don't know how to thank you for everything you've done for me and my family. Nico, don't mind to continue to bless you. You've done so much. But from Maya, I've told you not once, not twice. Stop praising and thanking me. It's not necessary. No, it is. Why? You've loved, cared, and you've always been there for me and my family. So? So you deserve my gratitude, my dear. Anyway, for me, all these praises and thanks that you're giving to me, they all belong to Almighty God. Because He's the one that makes everything possible. It's through His grace, love, and provision that we're even alive. I mean, so just forget it. I know, but it only takes a man with a good heart. A man with a beautiful heart, just like you. You know I love you. I love you too. <laughs> there is something I would want to tell you, but I don't even know how to start. Just say it. You know I really love you from the depth of my heart. And I would be the happiest woman on earth if we could be husband and wife. I don't know, but it, it will please me so much to wake up one morning and I see you lie beside me as my husband. It will please my soul. I don't know if I'm overstepping my boundary, but I'm just saying. Yes, you're right, but um, I spoke to Papa about it. And he said we should go to at least that like, so you have just barely three months to finish your service. That like, we should just wait and after that we can get married. I, I think he's right, we are. Mm, okay, okay. What about January? I think January is a perfect time. <laughs> I can't wait to be the mother of your kids. <laughs> Oh. Waking up next to you every oh. morning, sleeping next to you every Yes. I'm going to call you. 
That man don't to form Nanya. I don't know. The only thing I know is that I have checked myself totally and there is no way that I hurt from Nanya. I did not hurt her. The only wrong thing that I probably must have done to her is to love her genuinely. That's all. This is this is madness. I will go and talk to her. Please do. Do your best for me, please. What is it? You are a man. You have to be strong. I know that you love from Naya with all your heart. Please, try and be strong, okay? that told me that Olisa was all you wanted in a man and how good and nice he was to you. I know Olisa more than you do. There's no way you can compare Olisa to Desmond. Desmond is a rich guy. Olisa is still managing his life. I want someone that can comfortably take care of myself and my family. Please, I do not want to suffer. Olisa should go. I need a rich man. Yes. Okay. Now I get it right. So it is all about money now. Before, who doesn't want money? You that is seated here, don't you want to marry a rich man? Please, don't even go there. I want a rich man as a husband. Fumnanya. Fumnanya. Eh? It's not fair. Fumnimi. It's not fair at all what you're doing. I mean, I don't understand you. Seriously, what is even your problem? Are you not supposed to be happy for me? For my progress so far, as your sister, are you not supposed to be happy? How will I be happy that you're leaving, you're dumping a man that made you what you are today? Oh, please stop it. What are you talking about? So you're trying to say without Olisa, I would have been a dead person. Without Olisa, you wouldn't have been a graduate. Have you not heard stories about girls who did the same kind of thing you're doing to Olisa and how Nemesis caught up with them? Have you not? Hey, 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 hey. Ever, please, I beg you, you must go down. Please, stop it. Why are you carrying this piece of paper? It's your burden. What is it? If it's paining you so much and you feel I have hurt Olisa, why don't you go and console him by getting married to him so that I can rest? Eh? What is it? Funaya, you are shouting at me because I'm telling you the truth. I was busy inside before you called me out. I want to go back to your family. When you are done beating Olisa, you can, you can go. Mama, if I had seen this in a dream or somebody told me, I wouldn't have believed that this would ever eventually happen. Are you yourself the dreamer? Why, 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 why are you coming here to talk about it? Let me even ask you. I heard you've been going about telling everybody that you paid for my daughter's school fees. <laughs> eh? Talking, making so much noise about it. Would you be the first person to treat someone in the university? Eh? You've been ranting and raving, talking about it. Is it, is it supposed to be for public consumption? 
Muhammad. Do you know how much it cost me to see Umar through, through the university? How much? What is it that you've done for my daughter that no other man has done for somebody else? Come on, tell me now. Let's do checks and balances. Yes! Because for those four years, you know when you met my daughter, she was a virgin? Yes, a very religious girl. She would go to church with her chaplet, come back looking good, religious. You could feel the glow on her body. Yes! But you started eating her. Four good years, you've been, you've been diving into her affairs. Now her breasts are almost flat. A small girl like that with flat breasts. Is it a good sign? You're the one that has to pay me back. Nonsense. Mama. Hey, don't, don't call me that, Mama. I am not your mother. Don't you ever call me Mama again. This is what you mean to say to me, Mama. What do you want me to say? You want me to jump up and down because you think you paid for my daughter to go to school. Which university? Come on, university. That she was going to with uh, Keke. Did you ever drop her off? She will trot and come back and, and be very tired. But you still come in the night to pick her to go and do your job. Mama! Papa! Papa! Why are you singing mama, mama, mama? Like, 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 like as if your flavor. Don't you ever come in and meet your mother. Why do I even look like her? You're breaking my heart into pieces. Oh, I am breaking your heart. When you were breaking my daughter's something, you didn't know. Nonsense. Don't look. If you don't have anything to say to me, get out of my compound. Yes. Get out of my compound if I do something I will regret. I'll go. I'll go. But you don't forget that there is God in heaven, oh. And he's seen all of us. Oh. And he's coming up paying all of us. Hey! Yeah, he's already paying you. He has started paying you for deceiving my daughter. God said you should not sleep with a woman until you marry her. But you took my daughter for good years. Morning, afternoon, and night. You think I don't see her when she's sleeping out? You'll be delving into her affairs. Delving into her affairs. Delving into her affairs. Eh? Hey? My friend, if you don't have anything to say to walk out of my house. Get out of my compound. I've told you to stop calling me mama now. Get out now. See you. Stop looking at me like that. Hi! Oh, good years. Delving into somebody's affairs. Look at him. He's even crying. He's not even a man. Oh, you didn't even come with the car. Of course. The car will be back at the mechanics. I'm sure you're even owing them. You want to come and marry. Allow my daughter to marry someone that will take care of her. You've had enough. Oh, so I want to go so small that you cannot see me. Am Didn't I... you see me? Am I blind? Yeah. Of course I saw you. Oh, you saw me? Yeah. I'm afraid of you. I don't feel like greeting you. By the way, are you here to see me? Is it not my husband you've come to see? Go and see the person you've come to see now. Hmm. Oh, so man. You saw me and you don't greet. And I'm still seeing you. Please don't stop my mouth. Hey! Oh. You don't my friend. Oh, get it, get it, get it. Oh, get it, get it. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Sit down, sit down. Thank you. Let me just get you call. Oh, no, forget about call. Yeah, welcome, my brother. Welcome, my friend. Welcome. Um, okay. I want you to understand that all that has been happening in this, my house, I have no hands in them. I'm not part of any of these things you have been hearing. That's what I want you to understand. That's an average that used to go like this. An elder who says that he doesn't know how to make bridges is simply being common. Uh, 
everything happened so fast? This young man came from nowhere and brainwashed my family with sweet tongues and money. He was flashing money here and there. My wife and my daughter lost it. In fact, uh, in this house, man, and they decided to, to bite the finger that fed them. It's all right. The deed is done. Well, I just come to know if there is any bad thing my son did to your daughter that made her to tear his heart like this. Um, my brother, when I interviewed my daughter, she told me that Ulisa did nothing wrong. He never wronged her in any way. So, so in other words, your daughter deliberately decided to hurt my son in spite of all the good things he did for her. I am also hurt. I am as hurt as your son. Because my wife and Fumnaya, my daughter, they left me in shock. I was swept on the ground. I am telling you. And this house has not been what it used to be since then. I mean, pains. It's alright. It's alright. Since you say that my son did nothing, and like I said, I should be on my way. Mm. I still didn't want to take it. No, no, no. Thank you for your call. Um, thank you. Uh, what I know is that the children will, we cannot destroy us, the precious of food. Not when they are brought up by this kind of woman in calling one. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. I'm already trying to Thank you. I will be carrying my cross. Uh, I'll come my if my cross. I'll keep her in my bowl. She has done it everywhere. <clears throat> the eye has seen a lot of terrible things. That there is nothing that will make it shed blood. I just keep having this feeling that I'm dreaming. I want to wake up and find out that it's actually a dream that is not real. That's the way I feel. Hey! Thanks for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I got you anytime. You know those things you gave me? No one has ever given me such things before. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Say no more. What did I say? Say no more. Say no more. As long as you keep doing the right thing, you will get what you've never got in your whole entire life. Trust me. Thank you. Don't mention, man. Don't mention. That's my baby right there. I got her all the time. I need you in my life. I need you. I cannot wait. The dawn in the making, though. I know. The dawn in the making. Retarded shit. Well, meanwhile, pop. Just make do with this for your for your ass mask. You know, just make do. It's some mula right there. It's some mula right there. And you, stop acting like you don't need his money. You need this moolah more than anybody. Now you make do with this for your SMS too. I'm a philanthropist. I help people. That's what I do. I help people. That's what I do. The dog. That's man. what I do. Young man. That's what I do. I didn't tell you that I needed your money. I don't need your money. You have to do that. Uh-uh. Nani. Why is it that you're always ungrateful when somebody does something for you? Don't you know how to say thank you? Did I beg him for money? Please. 
Don't worry, I'll keep the money for you. It's okay, my darling. All for my baby. Otherwise, all for my baby. For who? This is all. This is all good. Huh? The dawn. I got you, mama. The dawn that makes things. I got you, mama. I got you, and I need my baby all the time, man. I need my baby. My baby is more important than anyone else. Your hips need you. You. Mama, I'll see you later in the day. Oh, okay. All right? I got baby. you. Holla at me. What did I say? Holla at you. Say it again. Holla at you. Say it one more time. Holla at you, baby. The last time. Holla at you, baby. I got you. I got you. I got you, mama. And I need you. <laughs> Say, look at it's giving me money for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, it's not, it's not a laughing matter at all. It's not a laughing matter. Because since I was born, I've never been this embarrassed before. Never. For what now? My good friend, I understand how you feel. If you will listen to my advice, I will tell you to forget everything that has to do with from Nana. Forget it. She's married already, you can't reverse it. All I want you to do is to pull yourself together and start a new life. If a prophet had told me that this was going to happen before now, I would have spat on his face, trust me. I don't care how, how big the person would have been. To me, go back to the city and move on with your life. Before you know it, you'll forget everything that has to do with from now. You're going back to the city tomorrow. That's it. That's what I want you to do. But this is not fair. Why, why are people like this? Everybody cannot be like you, my brother. Did like this. They can't be like you. Come on. You are one boy. Oh, 
you think it's in the past. Funanya, what you did to Olisa cannot be forgotten easily. Olisa sacrificed everything for you to graduate from university. And all you could do to pay him back is this. Eh, uh, Bera, please let me hear what. What's your problem? Who will see a man like that's one the dawn? Mind the word, the dawn in quotes, and leave him for for Olisa. For what now? Why should I do that? Are you an enemy of progress? Eh? And for your information, my dear, my husband is taking me to SA. That is South Africa. Because I know you don't know the meaning. Oh, <laughs> you're just a village girl. <laughs> oh yes. And we're going to live there forever. <laughs> and you think life is a bed of roses over there? Hmm. Ever, what is your problem? Why can't you be happy at least for once for your sister that is progressing? Why can't you be happy? I cannot be happy for what you did to Elisa. Olisa does not deserve such wickedness. Oh, Naya. You want to marry Olisa? Why are you so in love with Olisa? Go and marry him now. If that is your problem, go and marry him. I have done him. I do not want him anymore. I have a better man. You're not even ashamed of yourself. Why are you jealous for me? It's not a to open your mouth and tell me that you're jealous. You're here whining your mouth. Can't you be happy? If you're happy for somebody else, good thing will come your way. Jealousy? Me. Jealous. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, Naya. Jealous of who? Jealous of what? Jealous of your destiny. <laughs> no, my sister. I am disappointed that you have lost your conscience. All because of what? Money! Shut up your mouth! I'm even very, very stupid to have come here to show you my tiny life. Can you imagine? I wasted my skill to come here to, to receive insult from you. And if you don't attend, you will remain in this village. Jealousy! I don't know how I'm going to take this. It's too much for me to bear. Thank you, Tessie. I will talk to you like a father talks to his son. It is needless crying over spilled milk. Man has followed money. And I will advise you to screw up your courage. Be a man. Just carry on with your life. You will find love in no time. Oh? Well, I've heard what you said. Uh, I'll be going. No! Don't go! Sit down there and cry like a baby. Nah, nah. Sit down here. Stop that now. Why? What did I do to you, sir? What did I do to you? Why, why would you treat me in this manner? I, I, did you forget that we're going to get married? Hey! Right? Melissa, please! I will appreciate it if you respect the fact that I'm someone else's now. My husband, Desmond the Dawn, will not be happy seeing us together. Please! What is my offense? What did I do wrong? Is there anything that you ever wanted that I did not go out even out of my way to provide for you? Come on. You should have at least advised me to go on my own. That should have sorted out my life. Of course you can sort out your life if you want to now. Move on with your life. Am I holding you? The dawn said I can be managing this for now. Desmond! Desmond the dawn! The dawn! The man that knows money. Of 
speaks money and does money things. How many men can do this? It only takes a rich man to give his wife this kind of guy. Eh? Just to manage. My wife he arranges for the member. My husband is the lost surprises. He cares for me. He protects me. He loves me so much. And above all, he will chat for me. Day, 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 day. Oh, God brought this man into this family to take away the suffering. <laughs> that we have suffering since. Yeah. Now we shall be happy and enjoy. Go ahead, right. Hey! This is true. I didn't even know you were coming. Mm -hmm. Lots of fish. Eh? Mangala. You know that money that Don gave me the last time? Mm -hmm. I entered the market and I bought a uh, chunky chunky pieces of uh, fish. Mm -hmm. Hey! Oh, are you sure the guy is rough enough? Yes, he's rough enough. Hey! Hey! Tell me what I can do. Show me. When love goes away, it may never come back again. Don't break the heart that loves you. Don't break the heart that loves you. Traveling back to the city with my husband tomorrow. Then, after two weeks, we'll be hitting SA, South Africa. I'm not saying anything. Hmm. I just pray that one day you come back to your senses. Goodbye. What kind of jealousy is this? This your jealousy is too obvious. What's your problem? Sometimes you behave as if you're somehow related to Olisa. Are you okay? What kind of jealousy do you have? Baby, where are you taking me to see? 
South Africa. Baby, every time you keep telling me soon, soon. Baby, I told my girlfriend in the village, I told the baby that I'll be going to South Africa. I can't just wait to call her with South Africa number so that she will know that I've arrived. Please, now, when are we going? Listen, 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 listen. Speaking of South Africa, is it a must that we go to South Africa together? But you promised to take me there. So? I was just curious. I can't just wait to go there. I just want to see Keep how Keep that curiosity to yourself. Stop bugging me. Yes, me. I don't understand you these days. Desmond, you have changed. This is not the Desmond I used to know. You get angry at every slightest provocation. Why? That's because you piss me off with your silly questions. Now let me tell you, not of this South African thing. Today is the first special day in my life. My birthday! <laughs> mm. Baby. You're making this sound like I've won one big contract or there's a big problem coming your way. So, your birthday. So what do I do? No, you don't understand you. I just told you that today is my birthday. A very special day in my life. And look at what you're saying to me. My own God's body. So what do you want? No, tell me. At least you should wish me well. Long life and prosperity is all I deserve. That's your right. Oh, my wonderful wife, precious, angelic wife, just said I should wish her a happy birthday. Be better than that. Hope that's enough. It's close. It is not enough. You aren't going anywhere. You should take me out. <laughs> all right, I heard you. I heard you. A cup of ice cream or two will do. They probably won't want this. Excuse me. Come on. Hey, Victor, bring me outside. Bring me outside. Hey, what can we do? Are you going now? No, 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 no. I'm not going out. I'm going in. See, you and your wife, Doctor. Why are you talking to me like that? You see, what I, you see what, what I keep telling you about this bitch? You see what I keep telling you about this girl? Bugging me all the time. What's the problem? I won't even have a moment of rest in this house. Uh, uh, I don't understand you. You were supposed to take me out. Take you out? As in what? I'm sorry to disappoint you. We never had that discussion. Do you understand me? Nigga, you see what I keep telling you? No, no, don't tell me to calm down, Jerry. I don't like that. She's fond of this. Now you listen and listen real good. Go right in there to the kitchen and prepare my meal. That's where you belong, at the other room. Your meal shouldn't be an excuse. Your meal is ready. I've oh, prepared it. All right. The issue is where you're going to. You heard me. Get out of here! Great. Yes. 
you guys never had food with me. I was the one responsible for your being this girl today. Yet you still don't appreciate me. What do I get in return? Nothing. Insult. Idiot. Can you afford this kind of a sweet sick mansion? You can't. 
knows the heart of the man. He came because he lives in nobody. He came because he lives with God. Understand what I'm saying. Mama, it's not easy for me. It's not easy for me. Let me repeat myself. I said, get me food with you. That's not, I demand to know what you are doing with a gun. Why do you have a gun in your house? You want to know what I'm doing with a gun? Yes! You want to know what I'm doing with a gun? Nobody 
soft with a woman. Have you made my breakfast? It's at the dining. My food is at the dining. Seriously, I'm not happy. I don't like the way you've been treating me lately. You don't treat me as your wife. Last night you dragged me as if I was a dog. Now you started it again. Please. You should stop this thing you're doing. I'm not feeling fine. I need money. I need money to go to the hospital and take care of myself. You need money to go to the hospital.
What business of yours is there? Somebody that won a lottery. 
By the way, have you finished enjoying your breath of fresh air with her? That's what they done. Nani, please, instead of you to sympathize with your daughter, you're here laughing at her. Oh, why should I find out when she's crying? She's crying because she wants to cry. <laughs> you can see that she's heartbroken. Oh, she's already heartbroken. No, don't worry, this is the beginning, is the starting point. Acupuncture of my dad. It's just that. This month is not my in-law. He is your in-law. So don't call him my in-law. Okay. Let's not argue over that. Okay. But I would like you to go and see him. So you can discuss this issue with our, with our daughter. I mean, why would he pull out a gun to shoot her? It doesn't make sense. If you go and represent yourself as her father, you should have respect for, for my daughter, our daughter. Did you not invite Anika, my brother, to stand by you when you wanted to give Funaya's hand in marriage? You can still go to Anika and uh, ask him to go and meet this month and bring the inquiry of whatever you demand. From all you're saying, it's obvious you don't want to. No problem. I will go and see him. But let me tell you something. It is quite unfortunate that there will be a man in the house and I will be expected to go and meet the Indian. No problem. I will be the man. I will go represent my daughter. You have been doing the work of the man in this house. So go ahead. Carry on with your good work. Carry on. No problem. This is your state of poverty from the day I married you. Still written all over you. And the decisions you take in life. This one would have blasted her head with that gun. My in-law. The door, the door. Oh, listen to me. Do not come in your in-law. Do you understand me? Hey, don't even step on the machine. Get there. Please. Please. Whatever Fumanya has done to you, forgive her. With time, she will learn. She will understand you better, and then you would understand her, and you people would live happily. Listen, Mama, as far as I'm concerned, your daughter is a whiz being on me. Eh? She's a whiz being on me. Whiz being? Yeah, that's all it is. What's whiz being? Okay, tell you something. You don't get it cold right now, huh? Cold? You don't understand me cold. Are you crying for full night? But she loves you. Oh, my dear son, she loves you. Please don't cry. Stop crying, my you know, Stop crying. Wait for me. The poor boy is crying. My daughter is equally crying. That means they love each other so much. Crying with his mouth wide open for that matter. Oh. Mama speak. Come. Mama speaks. Wait. Mama. Come. Mama. Hey, your mama come too. Mama. You would have waited for me, mama. Say, mana sticks. Mana. What 
happened? Tell me. Hey, there is no way I will go back to that house again. Do you know it's only God that saved me? Tell me exactly what happened. What is the problem? That boy almost shot me. He almost shot me with his gun. Why? There's no way I'm going back there. That boy is mad though. He is really mad. There's no way you're going back there. I cannot stay here. I need to go back to my husband's house. Are you saying I cannot go back to my husband's house again? Instead of you to thank God that I came out alive, you're here talking about going back to your husband's house. You're on your own. I, I, I didn't want to go back to my husband's house. I don't want to really just to want me. Come on me, come on me, mama. You understand me? Mama, why are you limping? Huh? Throw away! Can't see where that. That's how I said in his house. Please, yeah? okay, I'm sorry. Please. Oh, let me help you up. Okay. So you go and rest. find my way back home. I might get lost there. No, you will not get lost. I'm going to write down the directions for you and put down the address. There's no way you will get lost. Eh? So don't worry about that one. It will be taken care of. Uh, but with the address does not mean I can't get lost in the city. You know how city is. I is. can see that you, you really don't want to go. You're just big delivered. Eh? You're not a man in the real sense of the world. You're, you're just sitting like a woman, you don't want to do anything, no problem. Don't worry, I will handle this thing. Don't stop it. Thank you. Thank you. You want me to go and die for what I don't know. See? Fear me. Hmm? What are we going to do about this thing? This marriage thing? I've told you to stop using that word. We. It is you. Whatever you want to say, you say you on your own. When you were jumping from point to point, place to place, shouting the dumb, the dumb, you never believed that a day like this will come. You didn't believe. A daughter, just your only child. 
A man came from nowhere. You've never seen him before, and you determined that this man was the best to marry your daughter. Mm. Boy, I am sorry for not coming to you. And you know, you have this gift of seeing into the future. But the thing is, which way forward? Have you ever taken any of my words seriously? From mm. Naya, where are you going to? I'm going back to beg my husband. I'm going to Desmond. I am tired of all this. You're going back to Desmond's house? Yes. Do you want to die? Is it not better for me? Is it not better I die in my husband's house than to live here with the shame and disgrace from the villagers and from my father? Is it not better? Chen Kwan. My daughter, I can't allow that. You're not going anywhere. Mama, don't touch me. Don't touch me. I shouldn't touch you. You heard me. Is it me you're talking to like that? Try it one more time and I will dislocate your jaw for you. Mama, I will talk to you anyhow. Because you do not deserve my respect. You are responsible for my present predicaments. Look at me. What nonsense. Break my jaw now. Break my jaw. Let me see. Hey. Hey. So it is me that you're using that mouth. You used to suck this breast to abuse it. Eh? It shall never be well with you. Eh? Yes. It will not be well. Mama, it will not be well with you too. It will never be well with you. Look at you. Are you a good mother? Are you a good mother? Have you seen what you've done to me? You've ruined my life. I curse the day you conceived me. You're a very wicked woman. So you now curse me. With this mouth that you used to suck this bread, you now curse me. You know what? I disown you. Ah, look at what you're talking about. I disown you too. I do not even want you as my mother again. What have you done for me? You have misled me. Who useless your life? You useless your life with all this. You useless your life with all this. You useless your life with all this. And my God, my God will get you. What? As me, beg on your behalf. It's a lie. You're a liar. I cannot do that. Oh, Nanya, when I was busy begging you to think twice before you take a decision, you refused and you called me a jealous friend. Now you have come to me to help you beg on on your behalf. He said, like you, I cannot do it. Why are you talking like this? Please, I need your help. Please. Please, 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 please. From Naya. I beg you in the name of God. Please, we are not sisters anymore. We are not blood related anymore. Don't call me your sister again. If you want to talk to Lisa, use your leg and your mouth and go and talk to me. I can never and will never do that. If you know where you took your bath, go there and collect your clothes. <laughs> Papa, I know I have really offended you. I have disrespected you in so many ways. I'm sorry. It wasn't my fault. It was Mama that deceived me. Papa, the truth is that I never loved this one. It was all this I loved so much. But Mama deceived me to get married to this one because, because he said he was going to take me to abroad. Can you hear yourself? Just listen to yourself. A grown-up like you a university graduate does not know her left and her right. So shameful. Oh. Oh. 
please forgive me. I'm not doing it again. I'm sorry, Papa. There is nothing to forgive here. You didn't offend me. The person you owe apology is Olisa. So go and look for Lisa. Wherever you may find him and apologize to him. Yes, sir. Only say, don't pick him my calls. I've called him several. He doesn't talk to me. Did I tell you I was hungry? Please take this in out of here. Some people left their husband's house to come and give my husband food in my husband's house. Take it away, please. Anyway, my darling, my shoes, your mind and girl. Honey, what would you like to eat? Just tell me, let me go and prepare for you. Did I beg you for food? Did I tell you I'm hungry? I don't need to eat, please. Just let me rest. When you're ready to eat, just tell me what you want. Hmm? I'll go and prepare it for you. some money.
because I don't have any projects in my mind against you. Hi. It's long gone. Lisa, if you don't forgive me, I can never forgive myself. I know from the depth of my soul, I have sinned against you. I've hurt you deeply. That's why I'm asking for your forgiveness. Please, forgive me. Please. Let, let me even ask you. Where is your husband? What's his name again? That's one of the dog. Is he away you here? Please, do not talk about him. I don't love him. Lisa, it's you I love. that this is not just me and you. Yeah. We're here people. We come from a place. It wasn't just me. My parents, the whole community were involved. My mother, my father, everybody. So, so how can you just come here and think it's just mm, our, our only decision? No, no, no. It doesn't work that way. Before I came here, I already, I already decided to apologize to anyone I have wronged. I will go to mother and apologize. I will go to father, anybody, any of your relations. Please. I'm ready to ask for forgiveness. Well, I don't think it's been necessary. Olisa. Olisa, please.
think you're pushing the state so far. Excuse me. Baby. Yeah. 
I hate my only son. No, my only son told me that he will be coming around. You are who? I don't know if he is around here. Who is your who is your Lisa? Shut up! Shut up your smelly mouth. Let me ask you, what business do you have to do? I beg you, put me on. I am very, very sorry. I know I have wronged you and Papa. And I'm not supposed to be here to beg you. Please, I am very, very sorry. But so the truth is that since I left this house, I haven't been myself. The thought of all this makes me lose my mind. I'm sorry, please forgive me. You are a shameless girl. Hey. You are a shameless girl. Let it not be that she Let me tell you something. Holy oh, my son is married. Hey. If you know what to put for me, take your shameless self to your house. And go and just get out of my face I'm sorry. Please, I'm sorry. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. You leaders have seen the kind of embarrassment I faced today. If you were there, you would shed tears on me. Yeah? I'm telling you, his parents just walked out on me as if I was so invincible. I was talking to them, they behaved as if. I was just wasting my time. The next thing was they stood up and left. If the ground could open, I would have ate. Oh, nani. I didn't know you had no shame. So you had the face to go to that house again after what you did to their son. Eh? I think you do not know how much I love Olisa. Love? Yes. How much do you love Olisa? Please tell me. Oh, please leave me. Before you start looking for someone you, you will blame now. Please. Do you know you are very confused? I have never seen anyone as confused as you are in this life. You are just shameless. Hey. Hey, are you are you with me or not? Because I don't understand you. Why are you talking to me as if I'm a child? Because you act like one. You act like a child. Look for Naya. If I were you, I will leave this village and will not return in years. Why? A bearer. Please, from Naya, please. I am begging you in the name of God. Do not come to my house with your problems. I have my own problems. If you are looking for someone to talk to, talk to your mother. She knows it all. Please. Hi, Papa. Papa, you're welcome. Hey, it's not my clothes. Yeah, your clothes, Papa. I'm washing them. They are very dirty. Yes. Uh, I'm also roasting yam for you. I know you like roasted yam. Since when did you become this humble? Papa. Papa was never a bad fellow. It's just that Mama deceived me. You became a bad girl the day you disobeyed me and married that crazy fool. Papa, I've tried in so many ways to make you understand that I'm really, really sorry for what I did. Please, Papa, forgive me. Sorry. Sorry. I know you are uh, sorry indeed, but you know that no matter how fast a wound heals, the scars remain. Hi, 
I have brought you the, the yam. I roasted yam I made for you. Please come and eat. Let you know I have toothache. I can't eat this yam with this tooth. I know very well that you love this thing. I spent almost an hour trying to make it for you. Please do not turn it down. Please just taste it. But I can't eat it. I'm not going to enjoy myself. Take it away! I'm not in trouble. Don't know what it means to have that tooth. Are you deaf or something? I can see that you now feel that you have the right to enter inside my house, my store, and take whatever you like, right? What kind of a mother are you? It is very obvious to me now that you don't have conscience. You don't have it. Could you at least sit down for a minute and think? Think about the terrible things you've done. Can't you think? Look at what you've done to me. You kept me in this terrible condition. You misled me, Mama. Yes. You can't show any remorse. Not even me too. You can't show any remorse. I don't have a conscience. I should be the one that will be remorseful. You're the one that should be remorseful. You married a good man. A man that has money. That took care of you. You said it yourself. Rather than being a good wife, you went there, messed up yourself, and they sent you back home. Let me warn you. Don't you ever enter my kitchen nor my store to carry any of my food stuff. Do you understand what I'm saying? No sense. <laughs> What kind of mother are you? Hey! I feel like going away from that house. That house is like hell to me. When I walk in the village, people, people point at me, say nasty things about me, gossip with my name. I'm frustrated. I'm really frustrated. I wish, I wish you had listened to me. I wish you had listened to your father. All these things wouldn't have been happening. Now even my own father sees me as an outcast. He doesn't eat my food. My father doesn't eat what I cook. When I'm in the house, he practically runs away because he doesn't want to see me. What could be more than that? That is how bad it has become. But do you blame him? You don't have to blame him. All you need to do is just ask him for forgiveness. He has not even given me the opportunity to, to ask him for forgiveness. He hasn't even given me the opportunity to come any inch close to him. You don't need him to give you the chance or the opportunity to talk to him. You have to create a means and ask him for forgiveness. Just go and try and talk to him. Papa, I know I have let you down. I have failed you and I have disrespected you in so many ways. Please, I am here to ask for your forgiveness. 
<laughs> if you don't forgive me, my life will be more miserable than it is now. I will Away from me. No way. Even if he ate it, they give it to him and take it to his mouth. I mean, what 
death is done by a man or woman living or dead. Let me close you. Close the house. Close you for the fruit of everyone. Stop! 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 Huh? Oh, you want me to have a go sit down, sit by home and watch the shit go deliver in the theater? Huh? I will not be alive and watch somebody else. Somebody. No. Huh? The battle is all that you're talking about what? Look at what is happening. They have hypnotized me because I know that. But there is no need for what is. There is no need. But I'm, I'm, I'm not involved with this at all. I'm, don't, don't even count me on it. I, I, you're just wasting time. What was this? You have not even listened to me for once. Eh? What is that you're involved with? I'm not. I don't, I don't know. What? You are from the lineage of the lions. And lions. Oh, okay. 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 Police is actually in the village just because of from my here. What fool man are you talking about? The same ungrateful girl. <laughs> the same fool manya who broke your heart and followed another man. She has left her husband's house and my son want to bring her, want to take her. No. Want to take her. No, you don't have to. Are you on my Ask him to allow me. Did she use to join you? Did she sham you? Ask him. Ask him. <laughs> you mean you want to settle for a woman who almost ruined your life? Eh? What kind of madness is that? Ask eh? you. It will not happen. It will not happen. It is not madness. It is surprising and strange that you are joining Papa and Mama to, 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 to treat me like a small boy. Are you not a boy? Olisa, are you not a boy? Only you know You are a child. You are a small boy. What is all this? A boy again and you are still out. And then you do the car. Even if your head touches the sky, you still go now, son. Anyway, the truth is that if I had known that this is the reason why Papa called me for this meeting, I wouldn't have answered to it. And as it is right now, I have to take my leave. Eh? Excuse me. What is that? Hey! What is that, Oka? Hey! Hey! What is that, Oka? Hey! Hey! Come on, from Maya, from Maya, from Maya, I'm not in That was why I called you to come and witness for yourself. Because if a man sees a snake, eh? He can turn into me. How can a man take into his arm the same dog that beats his manhood? This is not ordinary. They have gone to a tedious aspect. And that will not work. It will not work for them. I can be here and fold my hands and watch them. Eh? Ruin my only son. I will show them why I'm calling you. They will see the reason I'm calling you. I will not watch them. I will not watch them. I will tell them I'm his wife. Whatever they call it. Tension is so high, please. Tension high. What happened? No, 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 no. We have to talk about it. I hope you're not having problems with your parents because of Umnaya. No, 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 no. Your mother complained bitterly about it. And honestly, when she was complaining, I thought she was joking. And I told her I will talk to you. Thank God I've seen you now. What's the problem? Like I said before, it's not something I want to talk about. But I want Naya to go find somewhere. That this hey, hey. We have to discuss it. 
because you're my friend. And as good friends, I have to be honest with you. I hope you're not planning or thinking of going back to that girl. To Naya. No, seriously, if, if you do, I, I, I will see you as a man who throws out his spit and goes back to the liquids. You see, why I'm saying it is because if you're crying, it's me you will come to. Hmm? I, I don't want you to go back to her again. Don't forget what she did to you. She dealt with you. You need to follow me. So we look for a place to relax and at release. Take fresh money. Talking about going to the drink. Do you have money with you? She's waiting. Well, listen. As your friend, I want you to tell me. Are you still interested in Fumnaya? Does it look to you like I'm still interested in her? You want to ask me a question? Yeah, but I'm family. asking it back to you. I'm putting it back to you. Have I, at any point in time, discussed the issue concerning from Naya? Whether I want her back or not? The way you're going about it shows that. <laughs> oh, yeah, girl. Yes? Are we going to drink or not? Listen, this girl treated you so bad. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Are you going to drink or you want me to leave it right so that you can continue your own? Ah. Understand why one will not have rest in his father's house. Yeah. This is my father's house. Oh, Lisa, so, I want to answer my question. I want to know why you walked out on us because you said you will not marry that wicked girl. That wicked girl. Eh? I mean, this is the reason why you let your husband's out. Far, far, far. You come here and start disturbing us. Is it fair? It's not important. It's not important. You think we will stay alive and allow somebody else to do on you? Just cover your head. You think that will happen? It will not happen. It won't. There's nobody to do on you. Okay. See here. And that's the reason you want to bring back the same girl. The same girl that almost ruined your life. <laughs> My life is not ruined. I've said that to you before. My life is. See the way my son is talking. My son is talking like someone the head is inside the evil forest. Like okay, a man. Which man? Which man? Hey! Your heart is still with that girl. No, no, my wife. It will not happen. It will not happen. You will not marry that girl. You won't marry that girl. Then you are just stressing yourself. You are stressing yourself or not. And it's not good for you. This is not important to you, well, it's not important. Enough! Oh, you are my friend. The spirit of our ancestors. We are in now. You are guide within the four walls of this compound. Dad, I am not in support of my son, Marin Umunaya. But if he goes ahead and marries her, my spirit will forever. Wherever they have gone to, that thing will not work. I promise you, it will not work. Oh my God, 
and tell him all these things. Oh, like because he cannot sit and allow this thing to happen. It won't happen. Okay? Where is it? Gods of our land, the spirit of my ancestors, I call to appease you with this color. I am from the lineage of the lions. And whoever touches the tail of a lion must be beaten by it. Ulisa, good that you are here. If you dare marry that girl, you know what I will do. I will get into this house, lock up myself then, and set myself ablaze. Then my spirit will always torment you. And I will join you. I will join you. Let's give Olita the chance to dance this dance of shame. Mm -hmm. dance, dance, dance this dance of shame. If anything happens to my brother, if anything happens to my brother, I will gather the old mother here and they will place a cuff on you. Let me on that. Do you know that that's going to happen? What? Look at him. No. This is Juju now. This is Juju in action. Auntie, there's nobody using spell on me. No not on me, I'm normal. You're yeah, normal? Yes. Do you look normal? Do you look normal? Like this. Yeah, I don't understand this. I want to go out. You're going where? I'm going, going out. Jesus. Will you sit down there? Sit down there! Fool! You're going where? I said sit down. Listen, if you dare step out of this place now, I'll just place a curse upon you. No, sir. Look at But why are you talking to Nancy family the sir? Shut up your mouth and sit down! down. Olisa, you are a small boy, you must listen to your father. Sit down. Sit down, Olisa. Sit, sit down. down. Sit down. If you step an inch here, Olisa, if you step an inch here, you will visit Mongo back today. Just believe it. Let him try it. Watch my mother. Hello? Oh, thank God. Hello, Pastor, please. Are you still around? Oh, thank you. Please, can you come to my brother's house? The devil wants to steal and destroy. Please, can you come quickly, please? Hey, it's very urgent. Hey, hey. okay, you're coming. Thank you. Please hurry, hurry. We are waiting. What? Thank you. God forbid. God forbid that I will allow this to happen. To see that girl. That girl and her mother have failed. They will know that I serve a powerful God. A God that I worship can never allow this to happen. I tell you that. But I, I, told, I told you there is no juju on me. Eh? <laughs> oh. See this one. You hear yourself? That is how people talk when they are under a spell if you don't know that. Let me tell you. Do you hear me? That is how they talk. Nobody is even interested in hearing my own opinion. Eh? You people are just talking Shut about... up your mouth. Which opinion? Which nonsense opinion? Shut I want to go out. I told you people that before. You are going where? I said, sit down and don't go to anywhere. Sit down. Lisa, sit down. Are you out of yourself? Listen to your father. Huh? Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Is it because I left you at this while? You are showing so disobedience. What's wrong with you? I'm the queen outside. Go. We need to stop. Oh. If you stop out of here, I will go to the house. Pastor is here. Pastor is here. Pastor, thank God you are here. An evil woman cast a spell on my nephew. Please. The devil is the devil is a liar. The devil is a liar. In Jesus' name, Father, we thank you for a day like this. May the way you delivered Shedak, Meshach, and Abednego, we want you to deliver this young man in Jesus' name. Father, we thank you for a day like this because we know you have done it. Because we know you have delivered for a day like this. Topics of Formula 1. There you go wrong, Papa. There you go wrong. 
because it's not only the head that knows everything. You should have asked me first. That's the point. That's why I said you. Nobody listened to me. Nobody. Okay, so what's the surprise? Well, I found a woman that I want to marry. Hmm? And she's coming here today. <laughs> Story. <laughs> okay, who is she? My sister is uh, one of the daughters. The cat is our cat is here. Which of? But well, well, look at me now, I'm, I'm happy expecting a piece of look at how I'm keeping up by. I go in there and come out. Oh my love, but don't change your face. You know, whenever you change your face, your, your anger is always very bad.
the humiliation, the embarrassment you and my mother caused me. Have you seen it? Have you seen my life? Thank you very much. But I have one thing to tell you. Until I die, I would never be able to forgive you for this. I will not. Good night. Is there anything wrong with you? Shake your head. Is there anything wrong with you? Are you asking me that question? Oh, yes! Something is wrong with my head. You do not know. I have gone insane. Look at me. I am not want to check on myself. I can't even stand up and go to my head. How can you do you and my mother? You encourage me to get married to death money. Look at my life. If you did not do that with my mother, all this wouldn't have happened to me. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.
know you had a lot of medical things. Who said so? I did. I saw it in your eyes. No. I was just getting lost in your beauty. Maybe <laughs> don't call me. Well, the truth about it, I didn't know it's where to start. So that I don't get too upset. Well, so when you now told me that your medical doctor, oh my god. <laughs> I said I'm finished. <laughs> Well, I mean, I never would have believed it that you would have accepted a man like myself. She's a trader. I mean, a businessman. A common man, for that matter. Mm, maybe you're not common. You're not common. Nothing mm. about you is common. Yes. Don't you ever, ever qualify yourself as such thing again. Thank you. <laughs> you're my hero. You know it. That guy saw you at the the moment I set my eyes on you. There is this thing, you don't know what it's about. I think just, just started drawing me to you, you know? The way you smile, your structure. I just say to myself, this is the kind of man I need in my husband. Mm. Everything about you was just so powerful. And then, you asked me out. For lunch. And I said, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you because this is prayer answered. That's oh, finally answered my prayer. And he answered it. Yes, he did. He did. Is it Come and rest. Yeah. You need to rest. I will rest when I'm done, okay? You need to rest. Mama, your daughter needs help, okay? You've been doing nothing by yourself. Let me assist you. Thank you. Just hurry up so that you have to rest, right? Okay? Just go away until you be done, alright? Yes. I think God knew why he pushed for my arms. 
washed man too. You don't get it after you. Hey! Despite her education, a medical doctor like that, she is still up. to the things you're taking to the city. Uh -uh, Mama, you don't have to bother yourself, eh? We're supposed to be the ones giving you, not the other way around, eh? My dear, you always have the right way to Okay, Mama, let me take this aside. Okay. Come on, Oh, Come now, you're cool. Come now, you're cool. Come now, you're cool. No one has seen this since then. I heard you now you talk. Let me be there. All thanks to God. Call your husband for me. Abandoned me, she and her mother. She followed one man that they, they felt was very rich. Now she's coming back to look for what I do not know. My husband, is it the same, the same girl and teacher you told me about? She was the one. Look, but I didn't know she was the one. Tell me, see. She's the one. 
I suffer for the skill. I labored. There were even times that I didn't have at all. I went to Abore to make sure she was comfortable at school. At the end of the day, what did I get to eat? After graduation, we were supposed to have got to work. Mommy broke my heart, she shattered it. Left me in the middle of nowhere. Coming back for what? She doesn't know what it means to have a man that is real to the bone. Anyway, I, I, I came to inform you that Onyeka and his family are coming to pay my fight price next week. <laughs> Open the front side and put everything put inside. In. Put it at the back side. We have food in the city. We have enough. This one is for me. Okay. <laughs> this is the. Uh, village owned. Yeah. Okay. How many weeks are we going to give this one now? Okay. I want your husband to grow fat. Yeah. Where next is going to come to the village? <laughs> Mama, I'll feed him fat. Don't worry. Why won't I grow fat with all these things? And you, Olisa, when next people are home, I want to see your wife. Mama, you, you trust your son, man. You come, see you the know. position. Um, that position I'm using to carry him, I didn't say that. You didn't fight, you didn't have to. I'm good, man. Mama, take care of this man. I will, Mama, mm -hmm. I will. Take care of yourself, too. <laughs> you. Hey, Papa. Papa. Take care. Eh? Oh. Mm. Take care of yourself. Take care. You want to help me? Hey, let me help you. Don't stay in hand. I will not. <laughs> I'm I'm proud of you. You will make a good husband. Thank Love for the record, love a woman. 